So what's up y'all? It's, uh, it's JP from uh, Cop Chases and we are in Newport, New Hampshire. It's about 1 a.m. This is uh, one of the communities that's been hit pretty hard with the opiate thing and ODs and stuff. So I wanted to come over here and try to videotape the, ca the cop shop. I don't normally turn the camera on myself, but it's been kind of dead. So I wanted to just give everybody an update. I'm back out. It's almost like they have a tracker on my phone though. We hit like 27 communities, they're like not out and it's a Friday night. It's like one of the first warm weekends we've had. So it's been kind of crazy. So as you can see, they don't have a very big police apartment here. So uh, there's only, there's two cruises here. So I don't really, know how many they have they might have maybe three or four so there's two out there somewhere there's two vehicles here sitting so i imagine there's two cops on with two cruises there doesn't even look like they they left the station but this is a small police department um and they're usually pretty they're either pretty really nice and laid back or they're the complete opposite and they're dicks but it smells really bad in this city, in this town. It's kind of dead, downtown's kind of dead on a Friday night at 12 o'clock, like in Keene, there'll be like college kids everywhere. We're about to go back there. But I've been doing full-time parenting thing pretty much by myself, so now that I got a little bit of help, I can come out more and I got a driver that's fully engaged in, in uh, helping me do some cop chasing um, and police accountability. We're gonna walk right by the PD um, I think they have opening and close hours, so this is it right here. So there's the dispatch. I don't know if you can see the dispatch through the window. Well, yeah, that's uh, basically it. None of them have come out yet and tried to scope out anything. But this is an update. Wanted to give an update um, on a couple other things. Again, a lot of. Uh, messages um, on a couple videos I want to touch on before I turn off the camera um, the state cop lies to justify a stop video I actually recently got um, kind of heckled and a couple of our other admins got heckled by uh, Trupa Morell's Merrill's uh, wife which is kind of commendable because People that stick up for their spouses is very rare now. Like that loyalty is just, you don't see that shit anymore. So I want to kind of, you know, commend her for doing that shit. But uh, we're in Newport. Um, and uh, oh, by the way, Mrs. Merrill, I did file a complaint. It did go through and I did get an answer back. And no, he was not involved in that process. All right, so whatever he's telling you, he's a liar, okay? And if you and your state cop husband want to discuss that matter with me, we can happily sit down and I can share what the real law is instead of your delusional brain. I actually had a conversation for, with uh, Yaros, his supervisor, about the matter. And... uh I guess somebody threatened their family on some other site and she was blaming me for it. I, I do not condone that, by the way. Um, I'd rather them be alive so I can uh, videotape them and if they harass people, I want to harass them. But uh, I'm out. Peace. I'll be out all night, though. Hopefully I can get a cop video.